There are times that you just don't know what to say in prayer. There are times that you're in such difficulty that you don't know how to formulate the words to say, to explain it to God. Well, my friend, you don't have to explain to God. God already knows more than than you could ever say about your difficulty or situation. I'm going to teach you a simple technique that I have used 10,001 times. And it really is a help in time of need. It's just simply to remember two words. God help. When you are facing something that is too difficult for you to face. Just simply say silently in your mind, God help. And you will have an immediate relief come. You'll know that you're not alone. When you are in a situation in your work and you don't know what to do, you don't know where to go, You don't know who to ask. Ask God. God, help. In that instant of time, there is a touch upon you, upon your mind, upon your body that is coming through you with divine excellence. When God helps you, you have the very best help in the whole world on your side. You are not alone. You simply remember these two words, God, help. It only takes a second to say that, but it can change a lifetime. For God to come through in that moment, it requires your free will. God already knows your situation. God already is standing by to help, but you have free will. You have to call on God. Let's say it together. God, help. When you're facing a situation in healing, where you need healing in your body, And you don't know what to do. You don't know who to turn to next. You don't know what medicine you're supposed to take. God, help. When you're facing a financial difficulty and you don't know where the money is going to come from long term, God, help. When you are looking for a job and you've turned in the resumes, you've made the calls, and yet it appears like no one's calling you. Say those two words, God, help. It is an instantaneous prayer that is something that changes you at depth on the long term. To know that you have the power to connect with God, that you don't have to go through uh, a thousand words to explain it to God. When you don't have the time to, to go through the prayer or even the meditation, you have time all the time to say silently in your mind, God, help. And in that moment, I ask you, to let go and let God take over. And and then wait as God directs you to make the next move. And then you make it with a confidence that you wouldn't have had ordinarily. God, help. Say that now and allow that power to reverberate throughout you from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. God, help. In every part of your life, turn to God. In every situation that you're dealing with, in every person that is difficult in your life, 
where you have tried to communicate and tried to go the extra mile, stretched out your hand and it hasn't worked. Say these two words, God help. Trust in God. Because God will become trustworthy in your mind as you see with your eyes the incredible maze untwisting itself and situations working out better than you could have ever conceived of in mind or even in your dreams or visions. God help. We pray today that God helps. We pray that you have the power to let go and let God. We pray that you have the power in human mind just to remember those two words, to consent to God coming through you. God help. And may you take this prayer inside May it live with you forever. May it be something that you never forget. That it benefits you for the rest of your life because that is your God and my God. God help. We give thanks to God. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen.